Right now, the CFC, I think, is making some of its most important discoveries. What we, in the Catalyst for a Cure, are doing in glaucoma is at the cutting edge of the fields. It turns out that neurodegenerative diseases are multifaceted, they're complex diseases, and what that means, if we're going to cure them, if we're going to eliminate the disease, we actually have to attack multiple facets of the degenerative process. This is actually uh, a potentially revealing avenue of research because it may shed light not only on glaucoma but potentially what's going on in other uh, neuronal pathologies as well such as Alzheimer's, um, ALS or Parkinson's. What I hope to bring to the Catalyst for a Cure is an understanding of both healthy ganglion cell biology and some insights into uh, potential targets for rescuing and replenishing ganglion cells when they're injured in glaucoma. I'm very excited about the opportunity to work with this group. We have people who are biologists from the molecular level through the systems level, uh, blending with people who really are working much more in engineering, imaging, physical sciences, and it's through those sorts of collaborations that I think we could really come up with new ideas. One of the things that we've been um, uh, working on really hard lately is in, in the idea of achieving very high resolution in imaging. So what we now want to pursue, uh, now that we have that resolution, is to see how we, we can take advantage of that to study um, the, the function of the cell at that scale so that we can use that as a biomarker. Biomarkers are, are useful for uh, both early detection and disease progression monitoring. So uh, one of the uh, ways to save vision in, in glaucoma is to detect disease early. And the earlier de you detect it, the better chance of saving vision you have. Mm -hmm.